Hey, welcome back. So, finally getting around to make a video on my new trailer. Um, meant to make this video like a month and a half ago when I got this thing, but I've been super busy and the weather's been terrible. And so, could not get the time. So, I got the time and it's not that windy out and it's not snowing out. Um, this is a 2022 load trail 10,000 pound car hauler. Okay, it has LED lights on it, the ramps, uh, wood deck. Um, it's got the easy, the easy grease things. We pull this off, and there's a grease circ right there. You can grease with a grease gun. Um, the six lug rims. Uh, the trailer empties like 2,700 pounds. Full LED lighting on it. Um, has the all-weather connector um, locking thing there has the breakaway for the brakes you hook up uh, manual landing gear has the battery right there um, when I'd gotten this bad boy it had several lights out I had to change out um, what lights did I change out I want to change out uh, this light and then had to fix the wires on a couple other ones had to change out that light um had to do a few things to it though it is a 2022 um as you can tell manufacture date is 2021 um the way i actually got this trailer was um my o2 gray mustang gt that i had um i had found this trailer online and i had asked the fella if he would want to trade for it about two weeks went by and he said, uh, you know what, sure. So he came out and uh, straight across trade, he gave me the full-size tarp. And then he gave me the actual trailer hitch for it to connect to it. And he gave me this huge bin here um, that is full of straps and everything else. Um, I have a whole bunch of the straps. They're actually in the shop right now. I used them. Um, he gave me a whole bunch of stuff with it, some spare lights, spare connectors. Um, so, pretty good deal for me and him. Um, love the trailer. It is fantastic. It has dual uh, trailer brakes on it. Both axles have trailer brakes, um, not just one. And uh, works fantastic. Um, I had used this to tow home my 85 F-150 and uh, fit on here beautifully. It was just too much weight for my green truck. Um, but uh, the trailer itself is fantastic. Highly recommend it. Um, if I recall, it's like 83 inches inside to inside, I think. Um, 20 feet long. Um, it's got these little things here for two by fours to go in for rails. Um, I do have a winch I'm going to be mounting right here. It's like a winch on um, cars up here. I was going to mount a toolbox on this, but I don't want that much tongue weight on here, so I decided not to. And then these ramps are very nice. Um, I have used it to haul a few things already, and it's worked fantastic. Pulls very nice. Um, all the lights work on it now, and Greased it up really good, and I'm going to end up buying a spare tire for it because it did not come with a spare tire. So I do want to get one and probably mount it, you know, over here, over there, or something like that. So it's not all the weight up here, but uh, I do got to say I give this trailer a, a 10 out of 10 for stars so far. Um, I do plan to buy a electric landing gear too because uh, the pump one is just kind of a pain to do when it's cold out. But um, so yeah. Any questions on this bad boy, let me know. Um, like I say, it's a 10,000 pound trailer. Uh, let me get the actual real specs for you. Where was it? Uh, okay, so sorry. So it's a 9,990 pound trailer. And the trailer empty. Uh, where was it? I saw it on here. Um, somewhere on here it says, oh, right here trailer weight 2702 pounds and uh tire size and all stuff like that and then uh tire information right there so 
So hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. Make sure you like and share it. And uh, if you're not subscribed, hit that subscribe button for me. And we'll talk to you guys later. Thanks for watching.